who know me, you know that I like to spend my extra energy and time kind of giving back to people in the world who maybe life wasn't particularly easy for. A few years ago, I executive produced a series called The Lifeline Booth. You can see the link there or there. On that series, we gave back to the homeless community in Skid Row. I was really inspired by the people that I met down there, and it kind of forced me to go out and meet people that maybe I wouldn't otherwise have talked to. My takeaway from that series was that all anyone really wants in the world is just to feel loved and validated, and also that some of the greatest wisdom and knowledge comes from those that maybe society has forgotten about. One of my best friends in LA is Keith. Keith is so funny, handsome, witty, and probably one of the most intelligent people I know. Keith has also been homeless for 23 years. Some of my best conversations I've ever had in LA are with Keith. I just wanted to share with you guys my conversations with him, which are usually some of the most amazing conversations I've had ever in LA or in my life. So listen up, because Keith might say something that resonates with you and makes you think differently about yourself and possibly other people. Or like me, you just might find him hilarious and fascinating. If not, you just get to see another perspective, which you can never see too many perspectives in the world. Thanks guys, and enjoy this one. It's awesome. Hello, another day. We just picked up this jacket, which is in that bag from the UPS store, that charged me a $5 pickup fee, question mark. LA, <laughs> you greedy little. Anyways, so I uh, just picked up this jacket and I'm gonna go give it to one of my favorite people in LA. I asked him, what do you want, Keith? And he said, I just want a jacket, Allie. So uh, let's go find him. Let's find Keith. He's usually hanging out around here. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's sleeping. Dang, I don't wanna wake him up. I think I'll have to wake him up. Hopefully he doesn't get scared. Be like, natural. Like in the camera. Just be natural. Yeah, so let's see if it fits. Open it. Huh? I don't know. Let's just rip it. You got it? You're, you just train. If it doesn't fit, we can return and get a new one. Oh, it's got to fit. Oh, I hope it it's fits. It's better fit. It better fit. It better fit. Doesn't it look cool? Yeah. Let's see. Oh, let's see. Wow, Adley. Wow, that's a. Hey, Ad, I thank you. For you it. think? I really appreciate that. Adley. Look how warm it looks. Yeah. Oh my God, let's see. Hopefully it's big enough for you. No, no this is gonna work. Yeah? <gasps> oh, it looks smashing. It looks so good. It's perfect fit. Thank Do you, you think it's perfect fit though? Yes, well, yeah. Zip it up, let's see. Move it around, it move it around. Do a little, you know, put your arms up. Cause I want to make sure it fits. Oh, I gotta be Giselle Bouchard now. You, you turn me into Giselle. Oh, <laughs> you gotta be like Giselle. Giselle you gotta do a little walk. Claudia Schaefer, what the <laughs> hell? Tyra Banks. Should I say Tyra Banks? Yeah, you need to give me a smile. Put a black girl in there too somewhere. Give me a smile. Put a black girl in there, Tyra. I mean, it looks so durable, doesn't it? Wow. Is it too short on your arm? Oh my goodness, I have a coat. That's Adley, it's fine. Woo! Adley, fine, go fine, it's going through because I'm your guru, Miss Adley. You are my guru. Yes, yes, thank you. We're going to film. Yes. Because we're famous. So, what am I doing? Let's sit down. Let's sit down. Let's just sit right here. So, Keith is asking me what I'm doing with my life. So I'm trying to explain to him. Well, Ad, we just want all the best for Adley because she's so beautiful and wonderful and nice and we just wanted to be in a position with, with, with Julia Roberts and- <laughs> Right, Tia, Julia and, Roberts. She's the next uh, 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 Jennifer Lawrence, right? right? That's what we want, Jennifer Lawrence. J-Lo. Uh, J-Lo too, right, of course. Don't yeah, forget. with the dancing, don't uh, forget J-Lo. J-Lo. Both the J's. Right. So I was telling him I'm a caterer. Right. Told him I was bartending, he was, did right. not approve. But then when I told him it was for Catering company, he approved. Yeah, being a bartender in the nightclub can be kind of right. Like, you ever see the movie Cocktail with Tom Cruise? No. Yeah, was when he plays a bartender. That, that's like the 86 or something. Yeah, it's just, yeah. it can get crazy. It can get crazy. Right? It's, it's true, but you get so many tips. Right. right. You know? Yeah, at least fine, though. So I just showed Keith my dances, too. What'd you right. think? Wonderful, beautiful, gorgeous, Powerful. outstanding. Should right. Should change the world right. with dance or what? It, that's, it's, it's your world. You are the choreographer of your world. You, you do that's how you want to That's my favorite quote. Right? You are the dancer and the dance. Oh, really? Yeah, you know that quote? Who said that? I don't know who said it, but it's, it's, you are the, your life is your dance, you are the choreographer and the dancer. Okay. You know, so you make the moves okay. and you do the dance. Who's your favorite dancer, by the way? My favorite dancer? Oh, man. Oh, do you have one? What, what about Shirley MacLaine? Like old dancers? Yeah. Ginger Rogers, yeah, Gene Fred Astaire. Kelly. Yeah, right. Even Frank Sinatra had some cool moves. Yeah, Do you really? listen to him? I love Frank Sinatra. I love that. That's my favorite singer, Adley. Me too. Yeah. 
Oh no! He's Turn down. that thing off! Turn that thing off! Yeah. She's lying! She is lying! No, 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 no. no. Frank baby, Francis right? Albert Sinatra, Frank you know? baby, yeah. yeah. Well, so, Adley, he's really? Not yeah, Frank Sinatra, Eddie James, Lauren yeah. Hill. Well, that's that little gem from Eddie James to Lauren Hill, but okay, right, right. Okay. Yeah, it's changing in a little bit, yeah. but same. Yeah, yeah. Frank, Frank Sinatra is the best. What we yeah. have things in common, Adley? Course, what is the meaning of this? That's insane. That's why we're friends. I just went to the Hollywood or the Chinese theater for the first time, right. and I saw his hand. He was tiny. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Frank Sinatra. Tiny. Okay. Unless those hands are all fake, which. What, right when we're about to lean down, did they put a little plastic face? <laughs> oh, Adley, what a fake hand. <laughs> that's true, though. I mean, the competition's tough in this town, but that's, but you know, you, you say positive and you say true to yourself. Yeah. Right. Because I think Atlanta Borough City once said it's like the more you say true to yourself, the more you realize that's what, that's yeah. how you get by. That's what gets you by. That's Something all. Like that. Right, right, right. right that's right. what I'm realizing yeah. now. Yeah. That's the only right, thing that matters. Right, right, right. I know. Right. It just takes so long to. Right. Silence the bullshit so you can like listen to yourself, you yeah, know? Absolutely right. And also right. I don't know also, what it's like right. and also <laughs> I honestly right. have no idea right. what it's like to be a black right. man in the United States. This is like a talk show host. It's a talk show. Right, right. I don't we're know. Like, we're getting like into the host, it. Right. We're getting right. into it, Keith. Kind of like a Kathy Lee. I appreciate we, it. We just Kathy Lee thing we got. I'll be right, Oprah. Right. My pet peeve, I think, is when white people talk about it like they know what they're talking about. I hate the whole thing of like, oh, it's America. You can just pull yourself up by your bootstraps. Right, right, Not true. Right. If you don't have the proper education, it's really hard to right. fucking pull yourself up by your bootstraps. Right. Pet peeve. What's my pet peeve? What is your pet peeve? Pet peeve, oh, yeah. I have what? Tell me. Well, pe people who are not nice, people who are fake and phony and rude and mean. It's like no, yeah. that's my pet peeve. That's it's a like big you one. be respectful to everybody and, yeah. and, 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 and treat them the way you want to be treated. And people yeah. who are not, people don't always get it. They don't get that, and yeah. that can make me very upset. Yes. Yeah. Yes. My pet peeve: I don't like raised trucks in LA. What are you doing with that raised truck? Do you have some cows you need to pull, or are you just a disgusting polluter? You need to take up so much space. It's like we know your life is okay. Like you matter. You don't need validation through a huge raised truck. Is how I feel. Okay. Pollution. Man's gotta have his truck. Man's gotta have his truck. Wait. Man Ford. can just have his manlyhood. Ford and, and calm dies. Down. Man's. I know. That's man's Sad. way. Man's law. Mm, <laughs> Raised trucks. I heard Raised nobody trucks. Could, Raised nobody. trucks. What else? What right. else? What else? That's a lot of pet peeves. Okay. okay. You can't think of them now. But all positive. We want to keep it keep all it positive. positive. Yeah, we'll let's not positive. get too What are your right. favorite things? Favorite things. Sitting with very nice people like, like you, Adley. Yeah, that's <laughs> for one. I have a question. <laughs> right. What do you want to accomplish in this next year of your life? Do you think? It could be so simple. To be able to move forward gloriously upward okay as we move gloriously upward that's what we want right okay right. so just right. to bask in God's awesome glory and to move forward upward gloriously so keep evolving yes. in a positive yeah. manner yes keep it all positive right? me too my goal is to just let life happen and right. stop thinking I know how it's supposed to be but if you make 20 million dollars a picture will, will you still keep that attitude yeah oh uh, yeah I hope, so. oh, I, hope I, mean, so I hope so too I mean I'm trying to get the attitude of like yeah. This is my life, right. and that's okay. Right. Yeah, because we don't want you, you. We don't want you ever saying um. You get to the point where oh, excuse me, Jennifer Lawrence. Uh, get get get, out of, get, the, get the hell out of my way. Yeah, right. Uh, excuse me, get out of my way, Jennifer. I right. don't think we I don't ever, ever want no ever I don't, don't think want I that. Ever do that. <laughs> ah, no, no. <laughs> if I ever did, you'd have to find me. You'd have to find me and just like slap me. Right, right, right. Slap me across the face. Yeah, yeah. I won't ever become weird. Right. Okay. All right. I'm, no, we I'm don't ever cool, want weird. that. Yeah, we don't ever want. I can't become that, the right. bad weird. Yeah, never, no, never, no. never. This is it for Keith today. Okay. We're gonna maybe well, we'll, it's, maybe it's we'll keep fun. doing these talks, Keith. Sure. Since sure. you're my Buddha. A anytime, anytime. Okay. Pleasure all mine. Pleasure all mine. Miss Ali Fine goes. Jewish American Princess Ali Fine goes. Jewish American Princess. We're fabulous, yeah. right, Keith? Fabulous, fabulous, darling. Yeah. Fabulous. We'll Hollywood, fabulous. Right yes. <laughs> we'll do lunch. <laughs> we'll do lunch. <laughs> right. And give me.